Ha! This is Tomahawk, and welcome guys to a little science experiment video with yours truly. I haven't done one of these before, so I thought I'd give a go today trying out something really cool which I've seen. So basically, we're gonna have a go at popping balloons with fruit. Now you might be thinking, Tom, that sounds weird. I was really expecting this kind of video from you. Apple! Mango! Banana! So at this point, you're probably thinking, Tom has lost his mind. Actually, I haven't. There is some science behind today's video. So basically what we're gonna demonstrate today, hopefully, fingers crossed, is in oranges, limes, and lemons. Now there is a chemical in there called limonene, which basically is a hydrocarbon, which basically, when you peel this and just get the juices, you juice the skin of it onto the balloon, and that hydrocarbon will break down the plastic barrier on the balloon and cause it to pop. Now, that sounded so like blah, 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 but I hope it made sense to some of you. And if you didn't understand, it's fine because I'm going to demonstrate it with all these different lots of fruit and loads of different balloons. So, let's get chopping. First of all, you can need yourself an orange and a knife. Now, I've got a knife here and a bowl. Uh, knives are sharp, so, you know, if you don't feel comfortable with cutting this, get your parents to do it before you because knives are dangerous. And then I'm an adult and I don't trust myself with it. So what we're going to do is just going to kind of like cut off the top of this orange. So now we have the skin. Now the skin is what you need to make this work. This is what contains all of the limonene in. So basically what we're going to do is I'm going to get my balloon. Now this is where it might work, it might not. So I'm going to squeeze the juice on top. Go. That did it. That did it. It took a little bit of rubbing on it, but that went. Oh, that shocked me. <laughs> I was like rubbing it off the camera. Okay, okay, let's try that again. That was awesome. Scared the poop out of me. Let's do that again. Probably peaked my audio crazy. Okay, that was the orange. We'll try it again. Just to make sure it wasn't a fluke, and then we can try the lime and the lemon. But I have some different sized balloons for you, but I'll show you that in a minute. Let's try it again. Okay. Just smear it on. Oh! <laughs> Scared the poop out of me again. That was so cool. Right. I did warn everyone in the house that I was doing this before because everyone was going to be like, what is Tom doing in his room? Okay, so that is with the orange. Now let's try the lime. You put the lime in the coconut. Is that how it goes? Put the lime in the coconut. <laughs> Lemon. Balloon. Does this have as much limonene as the orange? It doesn't look like there's a lot coming off this. <laughs> Is this gonna work? There must be a higher concentration of limonene in the orange as opposed to the lemon. So, we've done that there. We've made that work with this size balloon. Time to go a little bigger. Oh baby, I got myself one of these punching ones. Woo! Nearly knocked the camera off. Right, okay. Let's see if this works. If this pops, this is gonna be like boom! Big one. Orange for an orange one. Here we go. That's orange juice on it. <laughs> I don't know if this is going to work. This is a bigger size. It's probably a lot more thicker. Let's give it a go. Make sure it's all, all nice and clean. Here we go. Bang! 
Okay, so I think this one's a little thick. Let's try one more. We've got one more suggestion. So I managed to get myself one of these uh, super size ladder balloons. Yeah, right. I'm excited. I've never got one of these before. This was. It was. Oh, that's a big balloon. That is a, that's a big balloon right there. Oh, did I get two? Oh, I only got one. I got two. Let's do the blue one. Right. Okay, so you pull this out. Okay, that's set off the. It's got a blue LED thing. Which is cool and all. Right. Let's blow this up. <laughs> right, so we have ourselves the uh, the one with the LED in. Look at how bright it is, it's completely blinding me. Oh wait. Right, let's give this puppy a try. We've got some fresh peel. Fresh. I think we've come to the conclusion that it only works with the cheap balloons because this was this is a must be a little bit more thick thicker than the other one that we use see i'm smearing it on there nothing's happened but that's why it's called a science experiment so guys that was it for today's science video uh science experiment video something a little different i hope you enjoyed it uh if you did enjoy today's video make sure to give it a like a uh, big thank you for watching and remember even when you need to finish on a bang, you still gotta risk it for a biscuit.